everybody my name is Valicia if you're new to my channel welcome if you're not what's up today I am going to be talking about parallel worlds by Michio Kaku and this is my March rereadathon pick for a nonfiction and I picked this book to better grasp the concepts that are in this book. This book mainly talks about different theories and concepts and different advanced technologies that we have to answer specific questions like what happened before the Big Bang Theory? And what is beyond our universe? Michio Kaku is a professor of theoretical physics at the University of New York. He specializes in string theory and also the theory of everything. I would say that Michio Kaku is kind of like the Einstein of our generation simply because Einstein kind of stops at the Big Bang Theory and Michio Kaku kind of picks it up and takes over from there with string theory. And then he's also very popular it's because of the way that he explains things. He's able to simplify and tell a story with uh, explaining his theory. This book is actually divided up into three parts. The first part would be the universe. The second part is the multiverse. And the third part is escaping into hyperspace. Part one mainly talks about the Big Bang Theory and how it ties into string theory. So I'm gonna do my best to explain this. So Kaku kind of explains the universe as being a soap bubble and we are like ants attached to the soap bubble. And string theory is the idea that there is a multitude of soap bubbles, the, the multiverse. So the Big Bang Theory is believed to be a collision of two soap bubbles colliding together or the separation of one into two. When I be talking, it's so hard not to let my country accent take over because I be ready to throw them R's up in there. So the idea of string theory kind of creates the idea of the multiverse and parallel worlds. And Michio Kaku is trying to put all these theories together, which is the theory of everything, which will be a uh, equation that will combine all the fundamental sources of everything. Part two goes mainly into parallel worlds and different dimensions. And then part three kind of goes more into science fiction. The book states that the laws of physics is a death sentence and the earth is headed for a global freeze. And the only way for humans to survive this is to somehow escape through a wormhole into another soap bubble into another universe. I felt like this book was pretty easy to follow. However, if you're not really into nonfiction or this topic, then it's not for you. A thing that I do like about this book is that each chapter is summarized at the end of the book and there is also a glossary for some common terms in here in the back also. Michio Kaku is really great at explaining things with the analogies he used. They make it very easy to follow and understand. Another thing that I loved about this book is Michio Kaku introduces faults within his theories. Like he tells you like all the paradoxes, like if this exists, then this must exist, but then that will denounce the first thing. The more I read things like this, the more I realize that nothing is really for certain. There isn't a lot about the universe and life that we know. Like these are just theories. They're not a hundred percent. And that's how you know that we're still kind of a baby planet. We're still learning, trying to figure shit out. And this book also covers the five stages of a universe. And we are currently still in the beginning phases. Overall, I gave this book four out of five stars. It's extremely entertaining and vivid. It challenges your imagination and kind of pushes boundaries. This is one of those books where you start off with one question and then after you finish, you have like 60 more questions. And they just keep piling and piling and piling and you're just like, what is life? These theories are just crazy to think about how small we are compared to something so large we can't even see it the universe it's so vast and complex i wish i knew the answers to everything there's just something cool about the unknown that is it for today make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next video because bye